Okay, so welcome back. Um, now I'm going to activate French command or French wing. So I'll actually activate Claire's regiment and uh, here's the command leader and he has units here, here, here and two of them are routed. So what we want to do is to fill up the space here that was uh, there's now a gap in the French line, so I want to try to fill that up. Uh, so I'll just move, I'll activate Claire, and he's drawing command from Marshal, Marshal de Saxe over here. And uh, we can count along the road. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, ah, maybe not. Let's see again. If I trace one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, he's in command from from the army leader. He does not need to roll for for his initiative. Okay, so, yeah, first of all, I'm going to move up this unit here to fill up this gap in the French line. Now, these units, I kind of want them to be able to fill up down here, so I'm going to back up one step. So that's one extra, this cost one, so one extra for backing up, so that's two. And uh, I think it will stay like that. When you back up, you have to roll for disorder. 66, which is more than the efficiency rating of this unit, which uh, is 24, so he's fine. And now this uh, Italian here is going to also do a backup. One, two. And then three, I think gonna move to that hex so this one actually also moved through a non-clear terrain hex so he has to roll for this order anyways with a plus five and that's a uh, fail so this guy is now disordered I rolled a three and uh, his efficiency rating is 24 And I think that's it for this command. I'll roll the initiative again. Uh, we have a French initiative. Uh, but no end turn marker advance. So the French army leader has uh, more, uh, one more bonus to his die roll. So the French win if you roll equal. Now I will activate this wing here. So I'll activate uh, uh, who's this? Shaban's wing. And uh, Gromont's uh, regiment will take care of this unit. So I have to ease in command from the sacks over here. And then I can trace six. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five. Six. He's actually. I wonder if he's out of command. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think he's out of command. This guy is probably out of command. So I. I think I'll have to roll initiative for. For Gromont's uh, regiment. 
has an initiative of five, so I need to roll five or less. I get a two, so they are in command. So first of all, we do remove disorder or do disorder recovery. And when you have a leader, you automatically remove the disorder. Uh, this guy has to roll. Oh, wait, that's an Englishman. I think that's it for this regiment. Now, what I want to do here is actually, I want to put a hook here. So, right now, this unit has an English unit in its flank, and he will have a negative effect on, on his morale. If he changes to, to hook formation, uh, these will all be front hexes. So, I think we'll, that's what we'll do for that one. Okay, so changing from line to hook is only one movement point. It costs one extra movement point because we're in uh, enemy zone of control. And uh, so this is two movement points. But actually, but actually, when we're when you're in non-clear terrain, that's the only thing you can do in that in your movement phase. So this formation change takes up. Is all that this this unit can do. Okay, so he's done. Um, I think this line looks fairly good, apart from the hole here. Um, we can look at what other uh, commands we can activate with Shaban's wing, uh, Shamont's uh, Shaban's wing. So, for example, so this guy is now activated. Actually, I should move this one one hex back to be able to be in command next time. So I'm going to move him there and then flip flip this guy. Uh, to show that he's finished. So the other members of the uh, Shaban's wing is this unit, for example. Dalancy. Uh, I don't think they will actually... I don't think they will do anything. So it's these units here, I think they're pretty... Also, this one. I think they 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 have a pretty nice defense there. So I think that's actually it for the French wing activation. I could also yeah together because he's stacked with Shaban. I can also activate uh, Chambonas brigade. And that's these three units, and that I think I will do, because I'm getting a feeling that we'll need these units down here. So I'll also activate those ones. And he has a command range of three. So they're all in command. Yeah, so the question is a little bit what to do with these ones because um, I guess I could move down. Move down here somewhere to have extra space to extra units to fill up here. But on the other hand, if I move these away and the English push here then it's a bit risky I think I will move them slightly down here so I'll do something like this one two three that's a disorder check and he fails 
disorder because he'd backed up. One, two, three, four. Yeah, they cost. Yeah, it cost two for these guys to change uh, facing. Actually, this is another disorder check. He also fails. This guy will do one, two, three. Or five rapid march. So when you rapid march, you get uh, times 1.5 the number of movement points, so you get six then. This gives him an additional plus five on his, uh, and he has to take a disorder check. So, but he passes 74. Yeah, actually he can still stay under here. But on the other hand, maybe I should move him out to help with the disorder recovery. And I think that's it for Chavon's wing. And uh, we roll initiative again. So now we get a special result. So five for the British or the, the Allies. Free combat segment. So free combat segment for the English or the, the Dutch. Hmm. Let me take a look. So the only good place that I could think of is here. So these two units could fire at this one. Now they are both disordered, but uh, so they can only fire with two from each hex here. But they can fire. Uh, they can both fire at this guy. That gives them four uh, times five because these are guard units. So, um, that's 20, 20, and the forest has defensive value of 15, so it's 1 to 1, 86, so let's have a look at the fire chart, 1 to 1, 86, It's one and the morale check. So these guys lose, lose a step. And they'll have to check their morale. Um, and they fail. That's zero six, so it's a, it's a fail. And they are shaken. And I will cause up one French loss. So we roll initiative again. This time it's uh, even. Because the French has more bonus so they get plus one in comparison to the, the allies. But the enter marker moves up because it's more than 10. This time, this is French initiative, but the enter marker moves up. Uh, on this hour, we have all the way down to, to 10 here, so, or 11, I guess. Uh, so there's still plenty of activations left. Okay, French activation. Okay, so I think I will activate this cavalry wing. This is Shaya. And Shaya's regiment is here, 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 and here. 
So we get a disorder recovery, and this is sort of the main reason actually why I'm activating these guys. So I get to remove this disorder. And now I guess I could also, I could actually charge one or more of these units with some of this cavalry. But I think I will wait until they actually move forward and then I can do a counter charge or an opportunity to charge. Uh, so I think I, I will just, that will be it for the French actually. And uh, we'll see who has the initiative next. It's the, the allies. No enter marker movement. Now the allies I think will start moving up the Dutch wing here. But I'll do that in the next video.